So we've got to get up there. What's up guys and welcome back to Need for Speed Payback. Today we've got a brand new abandoned car we want to check out and this is actually a, uh, a new type of abandoned car. So you guys know typically in the past abandoned cars have kind of been like you know old junkers that you have to, to grab and they're super slow and then you got to fix them up. This is actually one of the bosses in the game. It's her abandoned car. Faith Jones, she's the leader of the, uh, the Ember Valley Militia which is kind of like the off-road gang, and uh, we're going to be picking up her Ford Raptor, which is going to be awesome. So I think, I think this is what we want. I think this is going to gonna get us to the right area. Holy cow, that air. Oh my goodness. All right. This X6 is killing it, but yeah, I think uh, if we go down this way, yep, here it is. All right, we've got a billboard. There you and a brand new Ford Raptor. Let's get it, guys. I'm excited about this. All right, get the car to wrap. Let's, I mean, we might as well break the billboard, right? Might as well. Go ahead and take her down. Okay. Hello. Cop right in my face right off the bat. But yeah, this is Faith Jones Raptor. We dealt with her in the, the storyline quite a bit. She liked to talk a lot of trash, then we had to shut her down and eventually take over her squad, but now we're here to take over her car. It should be awesome. Dude, my voice is feeling rough this morning. I don't know if you guys can hear that. My first video of the day I'm trying to record and it's just like dead, gone. Good news is we're in a raptor, so we should be able to kind of beat up on people pretty well. We are big and heavy. I feel like the cop cars are kind of like unrealistically weighted in this game. They're kind of shoving us around a little bit more than I would expect they would be in a Raptor, but we'll be okay. And a little bit of drifting. Dude, this thing looks a little bit weird. Look at the camber. You guys see just how like, kind of a, the why you would do that, especially on the rear wheels. Do you guys see that? They're like 45 degrees sideways. Like that, in an off-road truck, that doesn't make any sense. Whew. Oh, he almost hit that pole there. We're doing all right. Okay, there we go. Getting sideways, getting some air. Got to get this thing back to Rav. We're only 1,400 yards away. Here we go. Look at our right so far. But yeah, this is um. This guy. I mean, this car is already set. Up. It's already tuned. It's fast. It's not an old junker. I don't even know if we're gonna be able to to customize it. You know what I mean? It's a totally different type of uh, abandoned car that we haven't seen before, which is kind of cool though. Like, what if they started all the the different. Gangs and leagues and bosses and stuff. What do we? What if we could start earning all those different vehicles? What's the I don't know. Contact we'll see. So we escaped. Two minutes, twenty-one seconds. We're back here at the garage, and let's see what we could do to fix this thing up. I here we go, boys. Another abandoned car. Good. Yes, I did, sir. All right. What do we got going on? Ooh, ooh. Unavailable on the paint. In wrap, unavailable on the, the performance tuning, unavailable on the customization. Performance customization, we can upgrade this up to 400, so that's good. Dude, okay. Only thing we could do is change the nitrous color, underglow, etc. Eh, I think we'll go ahead and skip on that. All right, so we're gonna head on over to a, uh, a tune-up shop. We're gonna get this thing leveled up to around level 400. We'll see if we can get close. And uh, then we'll take it to a couple of races, see what we could do. All right, guys, here we are. We're up to level 380 out of 399, so that's not too bad. We're up there towards the top, and uh, man, I guess that's about all we could do to this thing. Typically, I really like these abandoned finds because we could customize and make them look all our own, but we just really don't have that many options here. I mean, it looks good. I don't know if I really like the camber that much, especially in the rear. I feel like it looks a little bit ridiculous. I think if you just straighten those things out, it would look better and it'd perform better, too. But um, I guess that's what she wants to go with. So uh, let's go ahead and check out some events here. All right, here we go. 
Let's see what this raptor can do, boys. I'm kind of excited for this one. I know he customized... I don't think it... Was it a raptor earlier in the game, or was it just an F-150? I think it might have just been an F-150. Maybe it was a raptor. I'm not sure. It's probably a raptor. I think it need for speed. They like the crazy high-end cars. Woo! I mean, really, this thing probably performs a little bit better on-road than off-road, right? With this camber. No way! What just happened? Wait. Okay. I, I think the game glitched out. I, t <laughs> I was going to say, I don't... I didn't think I was going to be able to make it across that, but we totally did, and we definitely did go through the checkpoint. It said that next area was my next checkpoint, but I don't think the game could keep up with what was going on there. Holy cow, that was insane. All right. We're going to make sure we slow down enough to be able to hit that jump. That jump is no joke. All right, here we go. For Dale! Let's get it. Okay, Cletus, Bobby, Tess, Peach, D dude, what is going on with my voice? I'm sorry, I know it's probably hard to listen to. I lose my voice a lot as a YouTuber, but I haven't even, like, it's usually when I'm, like, trying to get, like, 10 days ahead because I'm going on a trip and I have to record, like, way more than normal. I haven't been doing that lately. I don't know what's going on. I just woke up out of nowhere and sound like I'm a six-pack-a-day smoker. Slow this down. We made it. Oh, we missed this checkpoint. That's what happened last time. We hit the original checkpoint, but we missed that one. I didn't even see that one. I don't even know if it showed up on our screen because we were bouncing all over the place. We were so messed up. Okay. We got this. We got Bobby Joe on our butt. Got a mile left on the race. Looking good so far. One thing I will say is this thing does not have very much nitrous. It's a little disappointing. And we can't... Can't really do a whole lot. I guess we could get the certain parts for it. If we were gonna, to get the outlaw parts, we could get a little bit more nitrous, but... just overall not tuned all that well it did absolutely destroy the competition though we'll take that all right the faith jones raptor we missed the challenge time i feel like that jump was still a little bit sketchy probably would have beat that challenge time if we would have would have hit that jump right but uh not too bad we'll take it all right so we're gonna move on to another race don't use any nitrous and finish the race before the timer runs out. Dude, I'll go for it. We're going to make an extra 18 grand if we can do it. Let's see what we got here. So we've got a, uh, a time trial. We haven't done one of these in a long time, so I figured we could check it out and out the episode with it. Looks like we've got a goal of beating 2 minutes and 14 seconds. So we'll see what that's all about. And we'll give it our best. Guess this thing does handle pretty well in the corners. That's where the camera kind of comes in. I just I feel like it. I feel like it looks pretty stupid. I'm not gonna lie. Woo. Oh, dude, this is the same area that we just picked this truck up from. I just realized. We literally we just. It's kind of funny. We're starting or ending off where we started. We went through that tunnel last time, though. We're going through here now. What is a tour bus doing out here? Doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Dude, we are flying 135 miles an hour. I would love to do this. Grab a Raptor, rent it, and just like go out on some sand dunes or something and just fly around, get air, and go crazy. Woo! All right. Taking a right. We're looking pretty good so far, boys. I'm liking it. I think we're looking pretty good for our time trial, that's for sure. 1.6 miles left. Okay. Woo! Yeah, dude, this thing handles the corners really well. But really, all off-road vehicles do, if I'm being honest. Like, our X6 that we started with was a beast.
I just like sliding all over the place. This is a fun type of race. And like I said, we don't really do too many off-road races. Especially nowadays in this game. We did when the game first came out, when we had to play through the story. But like, haven't been a ton of off-road vehicles released since then, dude. I want to use the nitrous so bad. My thumb's like hovering over the A button, just waiting to use it. I'm not going to. Dude, oh my goodness. First of all, that was insane. Second of all, I thought we were going to miss it. Dude, we are two seconds behind it again. Both races this time. We would have beat it if we could have used Nitrous, for sure. So we're just going to use that as, as an excuse. So uh, anyway, there you guys have it. I'm going to go, like, get a throat massage and drink some honey and tea because I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry my voice sounded a little bit rough in this episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed. And, uh... I'll see you guys later. We'll definitely, definitely play this game more in the future if they keep coming out with vehicles. So I'm going to see you guys later. Peace out.